Hello, this is the Superbox Elite Ultra with the Android 12 operating system on it. I got this off of Amazon for $180 out the door, shipped and everything. As you can see, it comes with four gigabytes of RAM and 128 gigabytes of storage. So if you're still looking for a Superbox, I would suggest look on Amazon, Timu and different places like that. But do not get any Superbox less than an Android 12 operating system. So any Superbox that's under an S5, you do not want. You do not want a Superbox under S5 because when you do third-party apps, you cannot navigate with the, with the remote, okay? So make sure you get a Superbox that have the Android 12 operating system on it. Trust me. You'll thank me for it later. So this is what came in the box. The actual super box, HDMI cable, the remote, and the power cable. Now the remote, it doesn't have any batteries, so you're gonna have to put your batteries in. So the first thing we wanna do is let's put the batteries in our remote, and it takes two AAA batteries. So you slide your covers off this way, um, can you see that? You push it up, your cover come off, and you put your batteries in. I hope you know how to put them in. Don't put them in wrong. Flat to the sp spring, and then put your cover back on, and then let's hook up the box to the TV, and we'll be in business, okay? So now we're gonna hook up the box to the TV. Okay, this is my super box, out the plastic. On the back, we have all these the connection but all we care about is the hdmi connection right here and the power connection right there where it says dc so we're going to hook up an hdmi cable here from the tv and the power plug that goes to the wall here's my hdmi cable and here's my power cable so we're going to plug these in and then turn our tv to the hdmi input that we have the box on okay okay I have this super box plugged in. This is on HDMI 2 on my particular TV. So this is how the super box boot up. And then we're gonna go through the setup of the box. So it's gonna go through all this right here. And as you can see, super box elite pops up. So far so good. It's working like it's supposed to. Okay, here we go. Here comes the good stuff, <laughs> okay, you ready? So let's set up our box. So what you need to do when you come to this disclaimer page, you need to scroll down. Oh, uh, at this point, we need to point the box, we need to point the remote directly at the box because we haven't set it up for Bluetooth, okay? So I'm gonna scroll down, I'm pointing at the box. So I, I went down and then I'm gonna scroll over to the right, pointing at the box, point it to the right, and now it's on the green, now I'm gonna hit the okay, point it towards the box. And now we're gonna get our internet. So what you wanna do, you wanna scroll over to the left, point it towards the box, and then scroll up, Point it towards the box and find your internet and sign in. Select the internet and put in your password, okay? So that's what I want you to do right now. Select your internet and put in your password. Okay, after you put in your password, let's scroll over to done. Point it towards the box. And after we get on the main page, we're going to set this remote up where we don't have to no longer point it towards the box for it to work, okay? So after you hit done, point it towards the box, we need to scroll down and over to connect. A lot of people mess up on this part where they don't do the down and over to connect. Go down, point it towards the box, and then over to the right to connect, and then hit the OK button. You need to do this, otherwise you will not see the green Android app guy in the app store to get your premium apps for your Superbox. So make sure that you are connected to the internet. 
And if you forget to do this, we can still connect to the internet later, but make sure you just do it right now, okay? So go ahead and hit the OK button and connect to the internet and we'll go to the next step. Okay, after you connect to the internet, we need to scroll over to the right and that's gonna bring us down to next. So we scroll over to the right after you connect to the internet and then we're gonna go to next. And that's gonna bring us to the next page, point it towards the box if it doesn't respond. And this is the, uh, it shows you the, the length of the screen. See, it's a little black gap here. We want it to go 100% so we can cover up this gap that we see there. And in order to cover up the 100%, we need to scroll up. Point it towards the box. Scroll up till you get to 100%. And now you no longer see that black gap there, okay? And then... Point it towards the box and hit the OK and you will be on the main page of your super box. There you go. Your box is now set up and you're on the main page. Now all you have to do is just, oh, at this point, let's program our remote <laughs> so we don't have to point it towards the box. So what you need to do is hit the microphone button, point it towards the box, Hit the microphone. Now you're going to get this. We need to hold the OK button and the back button at the same time. On our remote, hold the OK button and it's going to flash and the back button. And it's going to say searching and it's going to say pairing. Searching complete. Let's see if it pairs. I'm going to point it towards the box. It should have paired by now. I'm gonna take my hand off and hold it again. We need to make it pair. I'm trying to do it with one hand. It'll probably go easier for you when you do it with uh, two hands. Let me try this again, okay? Hold on. Okay, since mine didn't pair, I'm gonna hit the house button. Point it towards the box. And I'm going to re-hit the microphone to get that page back up. Okay, it's flashing. I'm going to hit the microphone, point it towards the box. And now it says parent, and now it's connected. So now, I no longer have to point my remote towards the box. See how I can scroll, and I'm not pointing it towards the box. This is great, okay? So that's how we pair our remote. And now your super box is pretty much set up. And these are the apps that you have that comes on the box. You have these apps, the Play Store and all this other stuff under the apps. And then under your app store, you have the Play Store and the App Store. The App Store is where you get all your good apps from, okay? so. That's pretty much the end of this tutorial of setting up your super box. Congratulations. And I'll make other videos showing you how to put your favorites in and all this other stuff. But for now, your box is set up. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. I could really use the subscriptions. Thank you very much. And watch my channel for more information. Bye.